previously on I'll admit when I had you released from Vault 111 I had no expectations that you'd survive out here in all this Damn. to not only do so but manage to find me to infiltrate the Institute itself extraordinary your unconditional love is overwhelming I think I need a moment. You're going to the Mass Fusion Building to acquire a beryllium agitator for us. Ah, man. I have one of those, but it's in my other pants. You wouldn't recognize one if it fell on your head. Went the wrong way, since Fallout likes to have a habit of having multiple quests on automatically, even without me doing so. So, the... Reactors this way? Okay. Alright, here we go, I guess. I'm here with Ali the Scientist, and I have Kate with me. And so far we've got rid of how many dozens of Brotherhood of Steel? people and can I just leave can I leave are you gonna get out my way thank you there's the reactor Not holy shit of work for its time. looks like a big pile of junk to me ha <laughs> Kate always talking shit that's why I love it all right so how do we get down here is it through this way yep it's through this way yeah, okay. Not do this way. So let me go through the other way since that pathway is completely blocked. I'm surprised there's no robots here. And I'm even more surprised that Brotherhood of Steel hasn't gotten this close yet. Levels are almost off the charts. I'll monitor things from here. Oh, how convenient from there. Ooh, the amount of radiation. Okay. So, I'm going to put on my hazmat suit. And being that I just took in some radiation, I'm going to also take right away as well. That way it can actually ease up on my levels. Alright, so how do I get in? Oh. Now cycling airlock. Please wait. Ooh. Decontamination sequence. Okay. I feel like these are sprinklers. Low key. Proceed. All right, everyone. Top of the reactor. Okay. This is crazy. Even though I am wearing my hazmat suit, I'm still getting radiation low key. It doesn't make any sense. Okay, I got it. Good condition too. I'm impressed. Must be security. security alert in the reactor chamber. Shit. What do you mean? Oh god, of course. Of course. Of course they would have lasers here. Ooh. This sucks. I hate this. Now it's going to take me one hell of a time to just to get rid of them. Do I have any... I have one stim pack. Oh my god, this sucks. Alright, I got one. Not bad. And I'm going to take the other one down. Come on, come on. Oh, come on! Okay. Perfect. 
Now, can I go? Can I leave? Yes. No. How come I can't leave? Open up this door. Hold on. Please okay. Wait. Perfect. I'm injured, but perfect. These fucking sprinklers, I swear. Did they just dipped on me? Oh. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Alright. That's one. Oh no, 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 no. This is not okay. I need fat boy for this. I can't. I'm not messing with that shit. Hold on. I need fat man. Damn, that boy is thick. Oh my god. That boy is thick. Oh, it mutated? Oh my god, it is shooting the shit out of me. Stop. Pissing me off. Why are you still shooting me? Oh my god, I am getting crammered. I can't even see for shit. And the thing is, I don't even have a ski like that. And this thing is still alive. What the hell? I'm surprised I'm still alive. Thank God I have mods. Okay, I'm here. Boom. At this point, I would have been dead. And I'm fully handicapped. <laughs> is there another one for real? Oh my god, bro. I am... I am handicapped. Oh no, there's an assault tron on top of that. I'm sorry, Kate. You're probably like down, but I gotta do something. Okay. Are we done? I just love how. While all this is happening, the scientist is just chilling in the background. Fuck you two. You know, it would be so nice to have stems right here instead of weapons. Are we getting out or not? Piece of shit. I'm gonna fat man this whole thing because I'm just tired. I am super tired. Of this bullshit. I love how after a while the game just conveniently heals you because they realize that you don't have any more stimmies left. I just love that. If both my arms are injured, how am I still able to hold this weapon? Who is that? Oh. Okay. Oh! Fuck off. How am I able to hold this weapon if both my arms are like, you know, not working? Alright, let's leave at this point because my, my leg is broken, my two arms are broken, my head is broken. Like, what else is broken at this point? No. Bye. These guys just don't know when they're beaten, do they? Why would no, they? they don't. They're a bunch of mindless soldiers. I'll help the synths buy some time. Make sure you get back to the Institute with the Agitator. I just want to go home. I'm tired of this, this Institute mission. Oh my god, there's more. These people just don't know when to quit. Alright, open the door. I'm just done. Yeah, that's the point. I just love how I'm using an atomic 
nuclear weapon. And no one seems to mind at all, like... Do I care? I really don't. I just want to leave this place. I actually miss my Minutemen. I really do. I miss my railroad people too. Really? Kate's down. Can't blame her. Oh, come on. You mean to tell me I didn't... Come on. Put in the fucking bullets, you piece of shit character. Like, I get it. You're handicapped, but come on. Great. I totally missed. Cool. This is too much. I'm annoyed. Like, I'm trying to leave. Ooh. How interesting. Detected. All right. Contact so, detected. Possibly. Are we done? Okay, I don't have any stimmies for you, honey. Oh my God, who else is in here? Cool. Okay, so that's cool. They're done. Ooh, this person was carrying steak and carrot the whole time? Alright, come on, Kate, let's go. All I still need to feel better. Wearing you out? Girl, how do you think I feel? Okay, so speak with Ellie, so I assume she's right behind me. Or not. Where's the sign? Oh shit. Oh shit. Ooh. So speak with Ellie. And she is at the Institute. So let's go. Oh my goodness. I just hate teleportation. At first, it seemed pretty glamorous, but me? with the amount of whiplash and... And, uh... What? Oh, I forgot Kate's not here. Okay. With the amount of whiplash and motion sickness that I could only imagine you'll get with teleportation, I'm not really a fan of it. The Institute's a big place. It might take a while to learn where everything is. Yeah, Dr. No Fillmore, kidding. I think that was enough excitement for well ever. Thank you, really. Couldn't have managed it without you. I'll make sure the agitator gets where it needs to go. I understand Father is anxious to get you involved in something else. You'd better not keep him waiting. Wow, another thing to do from Father. How cool. I am so excited. I wonder what he wants me to do. Yippee yo kai a. Oh shit, I'm stuck. Anyways, yippee yo kai a. I can't wait it to must help make you father proud to see all that father has done. Not really, he but I'm gonna keep comments to myself. Any additional pay for tenderness? All right, so he should be up here. The fact that he's dying, though, like, oh my God! You're sticking to the regimen we agreed upon. Yes, doctor. I'm taking all my little pills. Okay. And you've been getting extra rest. Are there many more of these questions? Mm-hmm. Any additional pain or tenderness? Not that I've noticed. No. I feel quite well. Interesting. How's your energy level? Feeling any fatigue? No more than I'd expect from a man of my age. Okay. You wanted to see me? Yes, thank you, Doctor. I think that will be all for now. I understand mass fusion was a success, despite interference from the Brotherhood of Steel. What did you hear? Dr. Fillmore's report was quite thorough. The Brotherhood's intervention must be placed in a larger context, however, given their penchant for hoarding technology. Future conflict with them is guaranteed. We are, after all, keepers of the most advanced technology in the Commonwealth, if not beyond. 
It also cannot go unnoticed that there were concerns within the Institute about mm -hmm. your allegiances. Oh, no. I, of course, never doubted your commitment to our cause. But by directly confronting the Brotherhood, I think you've put some others at ease. I'm proud of you, regardless. The Brotherhood is an issue for the future, and we must focus on the present. And look at me, rambling on like the old man I am. I'm glad I'm you're aware. Time. You're needed elsewhere at once. Oh, good. Here I was, afraid I'd have nothing to do. Very funny. Hmm. There's something that needs your immediate attention. This situation, I'm afraid, is something of your creation. However, creation? Unintentional. What do you mean? What do you mean by that? What's happened? Well, while you were assisting Dr. Fillmore, a second team was sent out to invite someone from the Commonwealth to join the Institute. Who? Apparently, there was some miscommunication, and this individual called for help, which arrived in the form of your minute. My understanding is that no shots have been fired. I would like it to stay that way. I need you to go there and speak to your Minutemen gathered outside. Insist that they stand down at once. Dr. Thompson is on site, and he will be your primary contact. I know you can resolve this situation, but it is of paramount importance that this special individual be brought to the Institute immediately. Why all this effort? What's so special about this person? Mr. Who Holmes, is this person? Despite a lack of formal training, our surveillance has shown he has incredible intellect. With his help, we may be able to drastically speed up work on the reactor. Okay. Mr. Wallace. From the Minute Man. Maybe I'm having a brain fart, but I'm just trying to figure out who this person is. New in Auberly. Alright, let me take a look here. Reach the house. Grey Garden. Alright, let's go. Ooh, my goodness. You see you see how you there's like some sort of a disoriented dizzy spell going on every time you go through the teleporter. Alright, so where am I going exactly? Okay, I see my Miniman buddies. What's good? What's happening? What's happening? Hey. What's going on here? You're an unexpected surprise. We could use the backup. These Institute bastards aren't getting away. They'll have to go through us to get out of there. We don't know quite what we're up against, but it's good you're here to help. Uh, how did you hear about this? Can you bring me up to speed on the situation? Commonwealth Citizen lives in that there observatory. Mm -hmm. Institute thug showed up to haul him off, only he spotted him coming. He managed to fire off a flare gun, got our attention, and we got up here as quick as we could. Now they're trapped inside. So, how do you want to play this? We thought about trying to lure him out here, since it'd be easier to kill him. But then we realized we probably ought to storm the place to make sure they can't disappear on us. That makes sense, right? So, you want to lead the charge? Have your men hold their ground. I'll go in and assess the situation. I don't think that's a good idea. Sir, we uh, have to act now. Or else we risk not only letting them get away, but taking one of ours with them. I wouldn't wish that fate on anyone. Are you going to lead us in there, or what? This whole thing is just a misunderstanding. A misunderstanding? Yes. I can't wait to hear this. Explain to me how this is a misunderstanding. You don't have all the information. I do, and I'm telling you this isn't what it looks like. That man's not in danger. Yeah, I don't think he's listening. You Are you serious? Right. If you're not... That man's life is on your head. I'll have my men stand down. But you'd better get in there and make sure you're right. Bro, I am the leader of the Minute Man, so calm the hell down. Anyways, let's go through and get get this going. All right, y'all need to stop right now. Calm down. Oh, 
Thank God you're here. I was starting to worry we might not make it out of this mess. How exactly did this happen? I'm not suited for field work. I've said that over and over, and they sent me anyway. There was no indication that Wallace had been in contact with anyone or was aware that we might be watching him. If I'd known, I'd... I don't know. Maybe I'd have tried to handle things differently. I know he's potentially important to Phase 3 and all, but I'm not sure it's worth putting ourselves in harm's way. Why did the Institute send you specifically? They thought I'd be able to relate to him with my scientific background. Okay. But I know they've been keeping an eye on him for years. Not sure how they originally found him, but probably don't want to know. But once they realized how smart he was and what an asset he could be for Phase 3, they watched pretty closely. I think they even fed him scientific material from time to time to see how good he was, you know, testing him to see if he was Institute material. Let's just get Wallace and get out of here. All right. No argument from me. Let's go. Right. There's just, well, there's a slight problem with that. Uh -huh. He doesn't want to go with us. I was thinking, maybe you could try and talk to him. Any advice on how to talk to him? Don't make him angry. Let him know we're not going to hurt him. In fact, his life would improve considerably. Cool. And I assume... Where is he? Ah, oh, he's here. Broken. Mr. Wallace, I'm here to talk to you. You're another one of, uh, of them, aren't you? Are you a robot? Sir? Are you okay? Have you been injured in any way? I'm locked in a bathroom to avoid killer robots. Of course I'm not okay. Okay. I've heard all the stories. I know exactly what happens to people when the Institute shows up. Well, it's not happening to me. Right. We're here to steal your kidneys and your memories. That's why I'm wasting time talking to you through the door. That's not funny. None of this is funny. Hmm. What can I say to convince you that we're not going to hurt you? That you're leaving and never coming back. Mm. Hey, hey, just calm down, okay? I just want to talk works. to you. Fine, fine. What do you want from me? The Institute needs your help, Mr. Wallace. It's as simple as that. My help? With... with what? The Institute has an engineering problem that your scientific expertise could help solve. In exchange for helping us out, you'd be granted access to the most advanced research facility imaginable. Whatever research you wanted to perform, anything, it's possible there. I promise. You'd be safe and secure in a way that's completely impossible anywhere else. Think about your future, Wallace. This is a way to secure it. I suppose that's one way to look at it. Exactly. Okay. Better for you, better for fine. them. Fine. I'll go. I'm looking forward to working for you, future director. Wow, oh. and a promotion? Okay. Come on. I think we've got this under control now. Thanks. I mean, thanks for the assist. Hey, I'm here to help. You're welcome. I really mean it. I owe you one. I'll Give see me you a... back in the institute. Oh, Kate didn't like that. But then again, Kate doesn't like it when I help people. Alright, Miniman buddies. Uh, looks like everyone is slowly walking away. So, you good? Hey, General. Oh, now it's General. Okay. I'm glad. I'm glad. Alright, so, let's speak to... Father. From what I hear, that rogue synth at Libertalia is a real menace. Glad it's back where it belongs. I love how people are just standing in this area, waiting for me to pop, and then once I come through, that's when they immediately start talking to me, as if I don't need a few minutes to just clear my head. Like, damn! Let me breathe, please. Okay. That's on the floor. Ah, there you are. Yeah, what's I good? I cannot express how pleased I am. 
Our new guest is familiarizing himself with his surroundings. Yet he's already pointed out several inefficiencies in our methods. With his help, Phase 3 will be ready in no time. And it's all thanks to you. I'm proud to help the Institute. Here's hoping it all pays off. At this point, there is no doubt. It will succeed, and very shortly. There is one more part for you to play, and I think you might enjoy it. Which it is one? time to announce our presence to the Commonwealth, to request that they do not interfere with our plans. You should be the one to do it. Me? Right, because no one up there suspects the Institute exists. This is not a joke. There has been too much posturing by too many groups. The world needs to know that we are in power and the Commonwealth is ours. As the incoming director, it is your responsibility to lead, to establish that place for the Institute's future. Please take this seriously. We've prepared some remarks for you to record. Once you're finished, we'll broadcast them to the entire Commonwealth. Use the microphone here and follow the script. It's quite simple. I'm sure you'll do fine, Mother. Wow. Oh, time for me to do the speech, so... For years now, you have suspected that the Institute still exists. That we are among you. It's true. But it's not the whole truth. We are here. And we are... Here to help. Our superior technology represents the future of the Commonwealth. Today, we activate our nuclear reactor, ensuring that we will persevere long after the world above ground ceases to exist. Ensuring that mankind has a future. We yes. have no desire to interfere in the unimportant details of your... daily lives. We simply insist that you do not interfere with Institute operations. To do so would result in... Unnecessary difficulties for all parties. Rest easy. Know that the future is... <laughs> Out of your control. I love this. In safe hands. And that mankind will thrive under our guidance. All right. So, what well, do you think about that? Interesting. Perhaps like good? not what we originally intended. But it will certainly get your point across. Now it's time to make sure that everyone hears it. How would you feel about making a little trip to Diamond City? There must be someone else you can send for whatever this is. We don't have any other reliable above-ground operatives. And the locals are somewhat familiar with you. The hmm. radio station in Diamond City is listened to by many in the Commonwealth. If we'd like the people to hear what we have to say, it's the best way to reach them. Before we preempt their broadcast. We need to ensure it reaches the maximum range possible. I've been assured that the necessary parts are on site. You'll just need to install them to boost the broadcasting power. Report back when you're done. We should be ready by then. Wow, going to Diamond City. Man, I wonder what Piper thinks about this. Thank you so much for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.